to paint Chinese painting, you need four basic materials. Uh, Chinese painting color, uh, paint, uh, Chinese uh, calligraphy and painting ink, uh, Chinese painting brushes, and rice papers, or we call it swan paper. Um, the Chinese painting, Chinese painting color uh, come with uh, a box like this, uh, 12 tubes. Um, that's all you need to, to paint, uh, to, to do a Chinese painting. And then uh, um, uh, right now they make it into a, a nice uh, tube, you know, uh, I mean uh, using nice, nicer materials to make a tube so it, it's not easy to break. So you just need to un un uh, uncap it and then, uh, you know, put it on, on, on the, uh, on the, on the palette, and then that's it. Uh, this is just like watercolor. So the difference between uh, Chinese color, painting color, and watercolor is this. Chinese painting color is, has more opacity and then more glue in it, so it does not, um, you know, uh, blend as much as watercolor. Uh, as, in fact, uh, the character of the Chinese painting uh, color is between um, watercolor and gouache. Here I'm going to show you how to use one plus to low uh, multi colors. Okay, so this plus, uh, you know, if you, if you use it has a long, long, uh, you know, hair. So uh, you you take water. How much water you take? You know, this is too much. It dropping. Okay, but you still need a lot of water. So after you take this much water, you do this. Okay, and then you you uh, you your water is not dropping. All right. Now we're going to low yellow here, vermilion. Uh, you know, and then the um, uh, scarlet, and then rouge, okay? So, um, okay, now, um, hold your brush. Let, let me, uh, you know, do, zoom it closer so you can uh, see it better, okay? So, hold your brush sideways, rotate your brush next to the color, okay? Try to load the, hello, uh, the, the yellow on the heel. And the vermilion, okay, next to the yellow, here is a scarlet, you know. So you can you can see the color range is from yellow to orangey to red, and then to uh, you know uh, rouge, dark red. Okay, on the tip. Now, after you load all the colors, and you tap your brush a little bit on the palette. Okay, so the color mix it with each other a little bit more evenly. And you are, uh, you know, uh, hold your brush sideways. Use the whole brush to paint. Okay, so you can paint one stroke. Okay, two stroke. Right. So you can you can paint the strokes. You know, um, one stroke. Then you you have a variety of values. See, from dark red to red to orange to yellow. At the beginning, you may have difficulty. Okay, uh, to do that. But after a while, and then you you are uh, you you're more familiar. Okay. You use this uh, uh, technique to paint flower a lot, okay? So um, see right now, it almost looks like a flower, right? Um, so next, I'm going to use this technique to show you how to paint uh, a peony.